I just <sighs> pausing it. I was, oh my God. Now I have to. You screw up the recording. When I, when I was visiting Aaron uh, a couple weeks ago, her dog uh, would uh, come into my bedroom. For, first night came in just once. And then the second night came in twice. And by the end of the uh, week, my stay there, he was coming in four times a night saying, I got to go out. I got to go out. Like, oh. uh, Aaron said, well, he doesn't have to be that much. <laughs> <laughs> like, Lord, he's exploiting that thing. He that sounds situation. like a cat. He's, he's <laughs> yeah. trans specific. <laughs> so here's yeah. here's Wyatt Wyatt on the in the cabal, and I resisted using the word secret cabal the whole time we were in trial with this arbcom, and it says Wyatt says uh, I said what a freaking waste of time. And I said, and the end result is everybody needs to be polite to each other is kind of what the result was. And why it says, whatever, it just shows that GSOW are decent people. It was, as we all predicted, a massive waste of time and effort with Rob being the only person truly and unfairly affected. So Rob, there you go. Um, I need to pause for a moment. So I will be right back. First station identification. <laughs> <laughs> what was the name of that video, Alan? Yeah, you should paste the uh, link. Just, so just go. I uh, just look up "dog versus cat." Okay. And, and you'll, you'll dog see friend that. versus cat friend. Or friend, okay. something like that. Yeah. It's been on the internet for a while. Uh, it hasn't been up lately, and it is hysterical. It's is there like, actually yeah. is there audio with it, or was it supposed? Yeah, to be there's sound? audio. There is. Audio. I think there's audio. Yeah, no, sure. it looks like there's several of them. Did you guys hear? Yeah. Did you guys hear anything? No. no, we were reading. Oh, shoot. The okay. I, I but we read, them. we read the But it had the, yeah, it had the subtitles. Yeah. So yeah, it's, yeah. Good. Yeah, yeah. it's actually it's better. It's better with the with the voices and the music, you know. Yeah. It's a little bit like it's that. Better one than the Blues Brothers. That thing that was going around <laughs> years ago that was like the diary of the cat versus the diary of the dog. Yeah. 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 Remember that I one? Think, and mm -hmm. I think someone told me, I think all those the, the guys in that video are all, I think, uh, they're all they were all uh, guys at Harvard or something like that. Oh really? Yeah. The diary oh, of the cat no, nothing was, else to do. Yeah. Day one of my captivity. Yeah, I yeah. love that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> my bowl is half full. I shall <laughs> soon perish. <laughs> <laughs> have you have you guys have you guys ever watched? There's these videos. Uh, um, uh, it's a, do, a do, I keep forgetting is a dachshund, a, a, a dachshund, and you know playing hockey and and stuff like that. It's it's uh, ah, I should find I'll find that sometime that. and put it up there. It's they're really funny. The good ones to watch are the Olive and Mabel. Are you guys mm. following the Olive and Mabel? They're cute. Oh, they're yeah, not they're, they're not common anymore, but boy, were they funny with the beginning, whereas dogs and two big uh, moms. Yeah, beautiful dogs. He's he's a, he was one of those um, sports casters who was out of business right when the COVID hit. He was one of those announcers, like what's happening on on you know the the soccer players are doing the uh, play, play, play yeah. by play, yeah. And so he was out of job whenever they when that happened. So then he started with his two dogs. He'd take them out for a walk and he'd do play by play, and it was funny. So funny. And he got really famous. They were all over um, MSNBC on the news. You could see it in the news and. He got a book deal and he got like a professional photographers following him around. And now he stopped doing them. I don't know why, but boy, God, they were well, he's so back good. at work. He's yeah. got sports again. I know, but they were probably made him a you know few million dollars just to. And all of them able are getting older too. They're like nine, eight, nine. Oh, the dogs? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're older. Oh, but they were so, f he did such a good job. Like he had like an yeah. Ikea uh, cabinet and he's like trying to put the cabinet together and the dogs are just looking at him. <laughs> like this, you know, and he says, yeah. oh, "You could help me." And then, then, and then, he, and then the next picture has one of the dogs with a screwdriver in its mouth, and he's still looking at him. And then, and then he, the camera looks down, and then he looks back up, and it's all made, and it's all beautiful, and everything. He's like, "How would you do that?" You know, they're just silly little two minute things, but they're good. Okay, so we're back. I think mm -hmm. I'm back. I'm back. Are you guys back? I'm back. Everybody back. back? Isabella's not back. Be Isabella. Looking on your screen. Okay, there's Gail. Okay, I still don't see Isabella. Okay. Uh, is anybody checked to see if Putin's still alive? <laughs> Donald nope. Trump? Are they still alive? Because last time checked, Putin's still alive. Okay, you, you, we're not going to need to check because if he dies, 
that will we'll know. That'll be uh, there'll be fireworks news. going on. There'll be breaking news. This. Can you yeah. imagine fireworks if Putin dies? Yeah, I don't think he's gonna live too much longer. You don't? Why not? You think somebody's gonna do? I think somebody yeah, within was... the Russian party is gonna say enough is enough. Yeah. He won't live that's out. I, I, I yeah. wish. I wish. Yeah, that's like that's like saying uh, you know enough is enough from the Republicans with Trump. Yeah, uh, yeah we, exactly. I, I've given up on ever being accountability free. And anything. the Republicans. Yeah, you're have probably right, budged. but I'm just wishful thinking. Well, Arcon yeah. didn't. They gave Rob a bad deal, so we we should start a GoFundMe and raise money to execute him. Assassinate. <laughs> I think that's illegal. <laughs> yeah, I, I, think, I think it is. But I support. Yeah. <laughs> Well, just let's, I offer let's make it a Russian ruble. Oh, Karen says it was going to be a mom that's going to take him out. <laughs> well, if anybody one does the take him out, it will be. It will hey, be. It will be somebody it. from his party. He takes out one of my kids. Boy, howdy. Okay. Anyway, getting off the subject and onto something happy. Happy. We're here for mm-hmm. happiness. This is why we started this damn thing. Is Bob Barker happy is alive. Is this, yes, thank you. Bob Barker is alive and well, and he's still <laughs> controlling the pet population having their pets spayed and neutered so we're going to go move oh, on wow. to the you see person here we go so we are at um 16 19 14 19 17 so everybody's doing right on there i mean we're really close to each other it's a span of from 19 to 14 so that's that's all make upable make upable <laughs> and the team that was in the lowest place just got gale so you guys gotta have Whoa. a bump. you got a bump now so i don't Game know what changer I, it could be. So I is don't that know my what, team? Yeah, Kevin, you're going to be up next. So, Kevin. Oh, my category is, I hope you guys did your homework. Oh, no, I didn't think to do that. Oh, Remember I told Lord. you last week I did Massachusetts. Mm, I did, did Rhode Island. I did New Hampshire. Oh. And I said, hey, you know, what about doing the Haven't rest of the Haven't we run out of states, states yet? Maybe you guys Vermont? want to go. In New England well, states, in, though. Yeah. In New England states, there's three other New England states. Do you know what the... Where? The it's drinking not like we listen to Rhode you. Island is. Can you it's name the? Uh, can you name the New England states? I yeah, could probably uh, name the New England time. states. Name okay, the I'm capitals. Sure. If you did all your homework, you wasted what? your time. I hope you learned something. <laughs> no, and tonight's trust, category. No, trust Kevin. Is Monster movies. And yes. Monster movies. All right. Kevin. Monster movie shot in New England. Yeah. Destroy New England. Oh, that's. Are so you ready? Funny. I completely forgot. I still should probably read those states. Well done, Kevin. That was well Are you ready? Right. Nice right, block. Three, two, one. Okay, I'm going to share a screen as soon as I find it. That's almost the cleanest screen I've ever, a desktop I've ever seen. Mine's almost that clean. Mine's cleaner. You're you're sharing your desktop. Do you know that? I'm trying to find it. Yeah. (gasps) We're going to have to make it up. There we go. Just don't show any answers. No, no answers on this. Monster movies. Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. From TV or film. Okay, this will be good. Identify the movie or the TV show or actor shown in the photo. Here we go. Okay. And I I don't know how to share this whole thing later. So if you want to snap screenshots or something, this is number oh. one. So what are you looking for for answers? The movie name of the movie the actress, or the actress. actress. Okay. How are we Either or is acceptable. Either, right, right. I give you many choices. You just pick one or the other. That's number one. That's number two. <clears throat> number three, fill in the blank. The Godzilla is the main not title, but if you know the rest of the title, or the starring actor, a very famous person starred in this movie. So one of those white boxes needs to be filled in to get a point. Godzilla, Godzilla. The next one, number four. Name the movie or the actor. He's a famous actor. 
Is it Bob Barker? That's funny, but no. <laughs> Name the movie or the actor. I, I, oops, I had to block out the guy's face because he's too famous, but can that's you the poster also, for one of the movies. Can you also reiterate the numbers? Yep, this one's number five. Number six, name the episode of this famous TV show or the name of the mod stuff. Ooh. Wow, look at the makeup on that. Are you sure this is number six and not number seven? Because no, that's six. I <laughs> left one blank. Because the number one is this. The title. Oh, number one is the title. Of this. Boy, look at that puss. Kevin, are we going to be able to take these into the rooms? He said, I'm not sure. I, I, can, I don't know how to do that. If someone knows how to share it, I can send them my file i don't know how to do that there's a button up in the upper right hand corner it says share really we'll go through go through these and, and okay see. great we'll go through them first the I'm next taking, one i'm taking number three. seven name the episode of this famous tv uh, show uh, or the monster uh, uh, uh. my screens my my phone is gonna have some pretty odd things <laughs> pictures in it number eight Name the made-for-TV movie, the episode, the monster, and the actress. Get any one correct and you score a point. So I'd like you to name them all. That way you have four shots at it. You know what I mean? Get any one of them correct and you get a point. Now I got two more that are tough. Name the movie or the character's name. There's not, there's not a human in there. This is like a puppet. God, but, when you see that, when you see these things frozen like this, they just look so fake. <laughs> yeah, it's different yep. when it's a movie and it's going by. There's, there's no set. actor in this. This is a puppet, I believe. So name the character's name. Paula should movie. have been here. She she would know these so well. And then name the movie or the actor who played the monster, not the kid. I don't want the kid's name. And then. If nobody gets a 10, there'll be a bonus question. If nobody gets a nine, there'll be two bonus questions. And there they are. So maybe we'll do these. OK. Yep. So try hitting that share button, see what happens. You can also do these on uh, Google, Google Sheets. It says, collaborate with us, share to cloud. Oh, that's not going to work. Save yeah. to cloud, it says. D. That's not going to work. No. Well, unless you want to share to your OneDrive and then make it yeah. public. Save it to your OneDrive yep. and you then share and, yeah. and copy the link and paste it into chat. Yeah. My screen back. <laughs> Was Michael Jordan in Thriller? Thriller, Thriller Night. Oh, I thought it was the uh, the woman from Spider Man. Oh wait, wait. MJ. So, so we got it. Faith and Romero, one of the two is doing it. So just ignore it. It's that. You guys go. got it? Yeah. Yeah. Thank they, you. Yeah. They did that quick. How did you do that so damn quick? Oh, he does IT. So he Three can't packs. finish his training, but he can do this. That's <laughs> awesome. It's very good, Romero. Very clever. Still go to your training. rooms. All right. Okay, I got to put Gail in her new room, which is, is it three? Yes. Yeah, Gail, you're coming with me. Come with me, Gail. I'm going to go there just to see. Does somebody need me to screen share or does somebody else want to screen share? So coffee milk is the is the drink of Rhode Island. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys need the screen? Uh, for what? To I have the screen I'd be chart. happy to do that if you'd like. I, I, I don't know the answer, so... I'm useful for this. But who needs to see the pictures? Oh, I have the I have the pictures. If you want okay, to everybody else has the pictures. They can see them. Carrie, can you see? You're probably on your phone, Carrie. I don't know if you can see them. Yeah. You know, I can see the first couple pictures. Okay, I'll, let me okay, share. Let me couple. share my screen. Oh, you got it. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah, I've got okay. it. The second one is uh, Young Frankenstein, I think. Yeah. Can you see them? First one is King Kong. King Kong. Yeah, King Kong. That was. Hey Ray, that's, that's, that's Faye Ray. Yeah. Hey, Ray, yeah. Oh, uh, did you want me to put the answers down then? Um, yeah. 
or yeah, why don't somebody else? We just, that? Yeah, just separate. Because we're going to need to concentrate on the pictures. You want so me to do that? I can do there. that. I'll put down the answers. It's fine. But we need to look at the pictures. Yep, so, I'm moving so, it out of the way. Okay, so the first one, was, I've got it. The first one was Fay Ray? Yeah. yeah. And King, King Kong. Kong. Well, we only Second need one, is, one of them, but we have both of them, I think. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Second one is Young Frankenstein. Okay, so I don't need to put the answers down. Gail's got it. No, I've got, I'm getting it. Okay, good. I'll, I'll show it to everybody after because I can't share both screens. Right. Um, I don't know this. The third one? I it's a good like one, like like but I don't know which one. Is it Henry Fonda? No. I Honda. I don't know. Godzilla was the starring actor, wasn't he? That's right. I think he wanted a human actor, however. Nobody's um, a Godzilla fan? I, I watched them, but I, I don't know who the actor is. And which one, which Godzilla that was. I don't think it was the first Godzilla. Four, it looks like Werewolf. It's Wolfman, what? isn't it? God, is isn't that, that awful? Yeah, Wolfman. I, is it? Wolfman? I, I was thinking it could be um, Jekyll and Hyde. No, isn't it? I was a teenage. Oh, I was a teenage werewolf. I was a teenage werewolf. Uh, I like that I've one. never seen it, but that fits. I've heard of the title. Yeah. He yeah, does I, that. Title I don't know who the actor is. Who is that? You may know? Nope. No. Drooling like that. That's disgusting. That's the idea. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> no idea now, on that one. Now I don't know. I don't think I know anything except maybe the next one. What about this one? This was number five. Very famous actor, she said. So, who was a very famous actor who appeared in a movie? It looks like George Papard. <laughs> from, his, from his from his hairline. Yes, from his hair. Did he was he an actor? I thought he was just a travel guy or something. George Papard. Oh, no, he's an actor. Famous, yeah. Is that the character that was on Twilight Zone on the on the? On it's the definitely wing? Twilight Zone. I remember he was on the wing. I don't know, but boy, look at that! The makeup looks awful. Yeah, he he I, he was on the wing of the plane. It was the one that um. Uh, if it's the wing of the plane, Star I think Trek. that's From Star Trek. He was he was coming home. And oh, it home. was um, William Shatner. William Shatner he was yeah. looking out the window, and what was the name of the? I didn't know that the monster, if it is that show, I don't remember this the is, monster this having is, the name. If it is, it's um, Kevin's favorite, favorite um, Twilight Zone. Oh, Kevin's here. Is it your favorite? I think it is. Uh, I don't know if it's the guy on the wing, but it could be because it looks like he's looking through the glass window and it's raining. And it, I think to remember he looks something like that, but I don't know. I don't know. I've never seen it frozen like this. If it's a TV show, then we can just say Twilight Zone. I want the episode uh, so name. It's called um, Terror on the Wing. I haven't seen it in so long. Let me yeah, think. I don't know the name. Of the, I never remember the names of the episode. Terror on the Wing. Terror. Terror on the Terror Wing. Terror in the Sky. Um, on the Wing. I think, I think it had something to do with the Wing. Terror in the Wing. And the monster is the monster on the wing. Yeah, I don't think he had a name. I don't remember him having a name except the episode. Well, then maybe we got the wrong sh episode. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. But I thought he looked like that. We did this look like that. Well, are they fake clips? I, I wrote Terror in the Sky, but we can mm -hmm. change that. Okay, this is Star Trek. This is Star a, Trek. This, yeah, this is the episode is called. Yeah. And the, the a monster, he's a captain. Gorn. That's a Gorn. Gorn, Gorn yeah. Gorn. G -O -R -N. That's exactly right. You got it. You got it, Vince. I it's a Gorn. And the episode, I don't remember the name of it. But oh, he walks really I slowly. I can't remember. We only need one. Okay, yeah. good. Yeah. Gorn. Captain Gorn. Gorn. Okay. Or no, he is a Gorn. No idea. That looks so phony. 
I can't even believe an actress was it had to st- sit there and keep a straight face with that fake looking thing there, that puppet thing there. I, it looks, doesn't that clothing look old fashioned? Yeah, 70s. I'm, I'm wondering, it looks like a shrunken head or something. That's from the 80s. It's, I have no idea what that is. But he's got four different things on it. Uh, I'm stuck. I think I know this one. I have it. Uh, well, that's a lot, I hope. <laughs> if you haven't seen it. No, no, I, I believe I have. Because I think I I have it's um uh twi- Twilight Zone. It's another Twilight Zone. It says it's a made for TV movie. Oh Twilight Zone uh, movie? Yeah. Made for TV movie, the episode The Monster, the actress get any correct. This is he who kills. He is a deadly hunter. That's what says in there. Is that what you want to put as the answer? He is no, that's what it hunter? says on the paper. Oh, okay. I have. I don't. Uh, I don't know it at all. So I have no guess even. No, I don't know either. So what, somebody want to give us a guess? Guess is better than nothing. How about um, uh, uh, what's his face from the? It's a it's a woman. It says it's an actress. Yeah, but I was thinking of the movies from the guy who goes and takes a rock and he weighs it. He was the explorer and he archaeologist. His name was um, Indiana Jones. Yeah, well, because it kind of oh. looks like that. But they weren't Character. Indiana Jones made for TV. This was a no, made for that, TV movie. That's not Indiana Jones. No, no I didn't. It's a woman because he says it's an actress. But I don't remember that character. I've watched the Indiana Jones things, and they were not made for TV. They make a fortune mm-hmm. in movie theaters. Okay, I have no guess. Okay, no guess, and we can come back to it if we have time. Let's try the next one. This is so unattractive. Look at those teeth, and it looks so phony. Is there isn't there one where he the the, the monster comes out of his belly? What is that movie? Aliens. Yeah, the a- alien sounds good. Alien? No, that's not an alien. That that looks totally yeah. Karen says no. I think I think I know that one. That one is. Um... He's in a basket, so maybe it's from Wizard of Oz. It's Toto. <laughs> he ain't Toto out of the basket. I think it's called The Thing. Okay. I think you're right, yeah. Yeah, The Thing. Okay. That's really interesting. Cool into, yeah. And I haven't a clue cool about this one either. This is Fred Savage. Oh, it was awful. That movie was a Fred flop. Savage, you're right. It was. That's the, not, he didn't want the boy. He didn't want the boy. He wants the monster. Yeah, the actor. Oh, the actor, or it says, "Oh, the actor played oh. the monster." Well, couldn't yeah, we the kid be the movie. monster? And the actor who's playing the kid is Fred. <laughs> I don't know the movie, so maybe the monster is the kid. I think that was um, a very famous comedian. Looks like he's got a uh, ear of corn on his head. Yeah, I, th- I think that was Howie Mandel. Okay. You're kidding me. Yeah, I'm not kidding. It was awful. It was, it was. An awful, awful movie. Karen, have you seen it? <laughs> I think so. I think it was really well, he bad. Said it was, he said it was a hard one. So. God, it was awful. Did he I say, think that that's was Howie Mandel. Okay, so what are we missing? Godzilla. We, no, we've got we're missing the. Okay, let me try this again. I don't know what I've got here. Let me try <laughs> it over again. Um, 
approach. Chat. I've lost the thing. So let me try it again. Okay, there we go. Um, there are the bonuses. Yeah. The, the second one was his sister. I think it's Latoya Jackson. It was his sister. Oh, is that right? I didn't know that. Yeah, I think it's I didn't Latoya. Know that. Latoya? I think I it's didn't Latoya. Know. I didn't know. I thought it was an actual actress who was like all thrilled to be starring with Michael Jackson. No, it was his sister. It was so weird. I want to see the family. Latoya. Well, there's only Janet and Latoya, and I don't think it was Janet. No, it was Latoya then. What actor appeared versus two of the above monsters in 60? What actor appeared versus two of the above monsters? Oh, you're saying Latoya Jackson was the second bonus? Yeah. Yeah. Um, That's all I know. In bonus one, it could be William Shatner. That's right. Good job, James. I couldn't even understand the question. <laughs> because <laughs> it says versus two of the above monsters and that would make sense that would make sense because it's definitely the 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 thing on the wing terror yeah. terror on the wing terror on the wing and suppose in the sky or let me put back here's the, I thought here's it was the a wing. yeah here are our answers so far um terror, terror you want on, the, on the wing instead of in the sky I think so. I'm almost positive it had the word wing in it. On the wing, yeah, I think so. And on George Bapard, that's just a uh, good, uh, I mean, that's a strong speculation on my part from interpreting the hair. I mean, it's not uh, excluding any other answers. But number six is definitely, that was the episode that had um, William Shatner in it. And yeah, so I, I, I think that's another thing. So that that's a good. I know that's we're on the right track. I didn't know they ever named the the thing on the wing though. I didn't think it had a name. How would they named all their episodes? No, but the it said one of the choices was the monster's name. Yeah. How would oh. he have known what the monster's name was like? Did he say, "Hey, what's your name"? Yeah. <laughs> Through the glass, and the yeah. monster said, "My name is George. What's your name?" <laughs> number eight, we don't have a guess on, but I think we're going to continue to not have a guess on that, right? Well, we know that the bonus, the first bonus is William Shatner. Mm -hmm. oh, that is something else. That face. This was that part one. She didn't number them. It makes it harder. That was the Star Trek. This is the one we had no, no, no guess on. That's the TV movie. So what's uh, what's TV movies that had monsters in them? And it's probably Africa something or other because it's got it's a it looks like a shrunken head, doesn't it? No, and it's it's got legs. It's got arms. Oh, yeah, it does, doesn't it? Let me think of a monster TV made for TV movie and just guess one. Yeah, why okay. is it say TV movie made for TV movie? The episode. So, why would there be a movie that would have an episode? Um, but it says TV movie and it says the episode. So, yeah, yeah. that doesn't make sense because it, no, if it had an episode, it'd be like a TV show. A movie would be just a standalone, right? Or right. Like, I I agree with you. I don't I don't understand it either. I blame I blame Kevin. So maybe it's a TV show. Not a movie. Jumanji? No. I never no. saw it. No, I don't, they didn't have scary looking monsters like that. They were just animals. Animals that were scary, but they weren't. It looks like awfully them. familiar. Like, I, I know I've seen it. Well, take off your glasses, Vincent. Maybe you'll be able to see it better. <laughs> Look at it with your glasses on. Too dark oh, for him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Karen, do you quilt? I say quilt ahead above your no, head. No, my mom does. Is it? Did she make that for you? Yeah. Oh, behind me. Oh, look at that. That is gorgeous. 
Yeah. Very pretty. Yeah. Leonard's wife also quilts. I yeah, my mom quilted, pretty. but we never did anything pretty fancy like that. Ours were very simple stuff or string quilts. Yeah. Ours were for necessity mm -hmm. to keep warm, not for beauty. <laughs> oh, what's the name of your Etsy shop? It's called uh it's not Etsy, it's um T oh. T uh Public. Okay. T Public. And yeah, that's what um I gave it to your dad. Okay. Once you're you're gonna have to get yourself a fuck Trump pillow. <laughs> and then send it to my ex. <laughs> that should be funny. Okay, so we're done. Christmas. We're done if we, if we, except that we don't even have to guess for this one. But that's all right, we have bonuses. Well, so it's only true. if those the only bonuses only count if no one gets a 10. Oh. Or an I eye. think given, unless there's somebody who's really an expert out there, I suspect that's the case. Yeah. I need mean, I will be My very dad will get them. You think he knows them? I think he will. Who will? My dad. All right. I'm ready to go back. I have no clue. I think we're as good as we're going to get. Yep. You guys just okay. did way more than I would have. All right. Bye, guys. Bye. Okay. Hey, Susan, the recording's in progress and you're muted. Oh, I was having a fast <laughs> conversation. I just said goodbye to everybody, my team and how great you guys have done. And I leave my room and it's back to my team again. So the, uh, rest of the, the rest of the people either know everything and are having good discussions about it or didn't know or didn't know anything and they're guessing like we were. That's possible i'm putting this up on facebook well vincent do you have a you said that one looked familiar do you have any guests we can put into it, our no guest space it looks awfully familiar it, it's an 80s show if it I sounds remember. like the right time period yeah, yeah. but um no unfortunately i can't you're falling Maybe. behind on your monster movies there. May uh, just a shot in the dark, just say um, Leprechaun. Well, I've never seen it, so that's very likely. Just, just, a, just a shot in the dark, Leprechaun. Okay. We didn't know the Godzilla one either. Oh, we're coming back. And we're back. You have to say it right, though. You have to say Godzilla. 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 What was the What was the song? Godzilla by uh, Edgar Winters Group. No, that was Frankenstein. Never mind. Godzilla. 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 That was a uh, uh, Oyster Cult. They had a song called Godzilla. Godzilla, yeah. Godzilla, 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 Godzilla. And I'm the only person who knows that. <laughs> Nobody else remembers that. I never I heard of that. I gets back. Because I don't want to be the only one who knows that. I think I've heard of it. It sounds familiar. They're all coming back. Yep. Yep, it's Blue Easter Cult Godzilla. Godzilla, ah, Godzilla, there Godzilla, you go. Godzilla yeah. Godzilla. With, with a terrible grimace and a terrible sound, he pulls the spitting high tension wires go, down. Go Godzilla. See, see, somebody else didn't know it. Oh yep. no, they say he's Good got song. to go, 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 Godzilla. That song is awesome. There goes got Tokyo. Go. Yeah, I was just trying to remember it. And at first I was thinking it was Frankenstein by Edward Winner's group, but it was actually. Don't don't sing anymore, Susan. You'll get demonetized. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Like anything I say is going to sound close to it. <laughs> you know, you're raking in that, all that cash. Oh, yeah. All, all none of those. <laughs>
Are you ready for answers? Yeah, sure. Spinning high tension. That was that was fun. Uh, Kevin. Okay, I hope it was fun. Better than the coffee milk is the straight drink of Rhode Island. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll take that any day over another state. Yeah. Yep. No, I like the states. No, states are boring. No, they're not boring. They're better than monster movies, which I never watch. I'm oh sure, boy, I'm you sure were on my team. Got them all. <laughs> <laughs> she loves those monster movies. What are you talking about? <coughs> First one was King Kong or Fay Ray. Either one of those, yeah. and these are actually in chronological order. That was 1933, King Kong or Fay Ray. Number two is 1935's Bride of Frankenstein. Oh! Yeah. Not. Was that Mel not Brooks obvious? Movie. <laughs> yeah, no, somebody thought it was a Mel Brooks one. movie. Okay, Bride of Frankenstein. What was the actress's name? Elsa Lanchester. I didn't know that one. And then um, the next one is Godzilla, King of Monsters, King of the Monsters, or Raymond Burr. Yes. yes. Hey, Raymond Burr. How did you guys know that? We got both. A lot of, of people didn't Raymond know Burr. Raymond Burr was in that movie. It was well, the only. Uh, it was the only serious Japan, Godzilla movie that was wasn't okay. Yes, it was a very good Godzilla yes. movie. Yes. Never heard of it. He was only Godzilla. You never heard of Godzilla? It's, it, it was very good, like Blues Brothers. It was the first one. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually pretty long, though. The next one is. I was a teenage I werewolf. A teenage yes. werewolf. Oh, I got it. Good job, hey, Jimmy. Karen, That's what I, I Karen said, and they that. also said no. Who was the Michael actor? Landon Who was the actor? Really? From, uh, yeah. So I, 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 I had it right. Michael Landon. My team. Oh, and 1958 movie, The Blob, with Steve McQueen. Yes. That was the blob. Was the blob. Steve McQueen. Yeah. It was like a blob. <laughs> the blob yeah, was, was all a, over the was train. Was a giant thing all over the train? What Wait, else? Uh, who was the actor? Who was the actor Steve in McQueen. the uh, the werewolf one? Michael Landon. Michael Landon. Michael Landon. Oh my well, God! We, it's if Mike... we got the wrong Bonanza? Michael, are we okay? Bonanza? Oh Jesus! You got <laughs> Michael Landon or the or I was a teenage werewolf. We, Either we one are not correctly. okay on that one. <laughs> we yeah, the we next one is the 1963 episode Nightmare at 20,000 Feet. I got the uh, name wrong. Gremlin. I apologize. Uh, okay, the yeah, 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 yeah. I apologize. And that was with William Shatner, wasn't it? Yes, yeah. right. We is are that your favorite the one? The monster. Is that your favorite one? 1967 Star Trek episode called Arena. Yes. Is that and what the was? monster was Rita. the Gorn. Yeah, he was a where, okay. where William he was a Shatner, Captain. where Kirk made gun yes. power. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry, he yes. yes. with, with diamonds as bullets, yes. Mm -hmm. well, well, and and he obviously measured everything out very accurately. Very accurately. You know, he's just <laughs> shoveling in. Some charcoal and sulfur. Yeah, and blew up in shoveling in sulfur in the correct ratio. I'm really upset. Head, Nightmare whatever. at 20,000 feet. I thought it was terror on the wing. The 1975 made for TV movie Trilogy of Terror. Yes. Yes. The episode was called Amelia, yeah, and the that. monster was the Zuni warrior, the Zuni <laughs> hunter, or the Zuni fetish doll. Fetish and, doll. and the actress played by Karen Black. Black. And if if Paula was here, I want to mention she's a Scientologist. Karen Black. And the 1982 movie. Basket case. Oh, oh. it was <laughs> three <laughs> versions of it. Yes, one, two, and three. One is a very good movie. And I will not be watching that. that. It's uh, considered one of the best funny. movies of all time. Was and, it? Um, so it was the monster was always Kyle Bradley. I don't expect anybody to get that one. The, the, it's his the twin brother that was like cut off his body. His his Siamese oh my twin. god, that's vaguely familiar now. Oh. And he was stuck in a basket. That sounds like a great movie. Dead. Let's watch it. Saved him. And kept them alive in a basket, and they got revenge mm. against all the doctors wow. and vets that performed. Wow. The I'm going to do that as a double feature one night with Blues Brothers first. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> a pretty good. It's a pretty good. good idea, uh, you can see which one's better. Movie. The reimagining of the Moses story. <laughs> <laughs> and in a basket. 1989, Little Monsters. Oh, but he's lovely. With Little Howie monsters, Mandel as the monster. Was called. We got that. That's oh, my team got that one. That Did was we get that one? We got it. Did anybody get a 10? Howie Mandel. Go, oh, Howie Mandel. Did anybody get a 10? No. Uh, okay, so the first bonus question is William Shatner. Yes! Yeah. Did anybody get a 10 now? Yes. yes. Okay, so the old, you don't need to know Ola Ray. I could. I got, I got that too. We got 11. We got 11. We get 10. Bonus points. Don't, count, don't count two bonus points because somebody yeah. got a 10. Yeah, okay. Ugh. 
Yeah, we got uh, we we got the so somebody um, got a ten with one bonus basket point. case wrong. Correct. Yeah, we only got basket case wrong. Yep. Oh God. <laughs> I thought I it was Toto. Basket case. Toto had been eaten by. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really bad looking Toto suit. I thought the monster ate Toto, and that was the name of the movie. Yes, Morphe. The, the, the monster, the monster, the the monster at Oz or something. Yeah. Can you okay. save the answer for the bonus? The second, just say the answer. Oh, Ola Ray. For the second bonus. Aaron, with all those what? actress names, she was on it. Who got it? Karen. Karen knows the Karen knows her monster all the movies. Actress names. She knew no, the actors. Karen, Karen, Karen knew the actors. I didn't know the name of the um, mm -hmm. movies. Mm -hmm. She's a ringer. You know that? Yeah, she is. She no, plays is. like, <laughs> oh, I don't know things. But we, then we, had she... a, we had a great team collab on that round. It was good. Everybody pitched in. Well, Kevin, we said terror at 30,000 feet. I think I know the answer, but. No, no, that's not fact, really in fact, it, that's though. why I didn't I didn't want to say that because I wasn't sure what the altitude was because they made the Twilight Zone movie and then they made another one and they kept changing the altitude and I wasn't positive what it was. So yep. it just said Gremlin. <laughs> did you get a Gremlin? Yes. Did you get Gremlin? Oh. Yes, yes. On the wing, so that counts. Yep. I didn't know he knew his name. How did he know his name? Oh. Did he did he tell him? Did he ask him? Did they just yeah. call him the Gremlin? He did sign language through the window while he was on the wing. <laughs> American sign language that he learned from a chimpanzee, surprisingly. No, yes. William Shatner spoke the words gremlin. I don't know. Gremlin he, is a man on the wing look, and all this look kind up of stuff. Gremlin. I don't look know if he gremlin. actually look ever did that. It, it was, somebody in the episode says gremlin. It was probably, it, it was probably he's the only in, one that sees it. in the credits that way. But yeah. I, it could have been in the know. credits. I, I, I think he's the only one that sees it. And have you seen the Saturday Night Live spoof on it? It's pretty funny. I'll have to remember. They have a bunch of Sounds they have a bunch familiar. of people on the wing doing barbecue and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice. Ted Cruz going to Cancun. Oh, <laughs> oh, we didn't even discuss what the monster was called. We screwed up. Uh Kevin, right. was Kevin, what I want to know is was that your favorite episode of all the Twilight Zones? Because I thought just no, was, no, not even in the top 10. Oh, well, fine. my favorite one is uh <laughs> will the real Martian please stand up? Oh. oh, that's a good one. My favorite so, is Pennies from Pennies, the Pennies for Your Thought. For that's your a thought. great one, too. It's in my top 10. That's and it's also William coin. Shatner. Oh, you flip any... the coin and it lands on its edge? Yeah. No, yes. that's not it. Did, did anyone see the... That's Penny for Your Thoughts. I, the one where they're sitting down, at, his car breaks down, and he's putting the penny in the oh, yeah. machine. A little fortune teller fortune. thing. Oh, oh fortune that's a different machine. one. That's called Penny for Your Thoughts, wasn't it? No. Oh, well, uh, maybe. It's called... Um, I don't know. I forgot. Yeah. It could be. <laughs> so did anybody see the, the remake in the current, well, the most recent Twilight Zone from about two years ago of, uh, of the Terra at 20,000 feet? I think it was Terra at 40,000 feet. Yes. Yeah. No. So they, they substituted a, a real monster for the guy, mm -hmm. the star of the, of the episode, finding an iPod in, in the compartment in front of the seat and listening to it. And it's a podcast of the crash of the plane he's on, giving Ooh. all the details of what happens cool. as the flight is going on. <laughs> Oh, thanks for spoiling it, Rob. No, that, that doesn't tell Way you what happens, go, but that's, that's, <laughs> that's the moment. Penny for your thoughts is the episode where the guy flips a coin and it lands on its edge, and then he can read right. people's minds. That makes sense, yeah. Oh, so in the newer Twilight Zone, it was Nightmare at 30,000 feet instead of Terror at 20. So they changed the word and the and the height. Right. Well, that was okay, the so one in the movie. Is that the one in the movie? Files on the movie. Can you guys see? Right. We're score now. This is what it's called. No, this scoring. is the, the this is the part of the this okay. is the part of the game where we score things. Like oh, okay. Luke of the what? Okay. What's, What's that? Score? Got too excited what, what's your score? No. Did anybody no. not get a ten? Did anybody not get a ten? Yes, Robert. <laughs> Fine. Come bite on, me. Rob. Don't make the bite other me. feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> he went to bite her. We had five. Okay, so five for us. Sorry, Rob. Not everybody's like into monster movies. Fine. That movie's that one's called Nick of Time. Nick of Time, know. really the one with oh, the because it's, the it's in the movie one. No, the one you're looking for with the with the the, the, the devil doll and the diamond. Oh, got it. Because he's like what? Nick. Because yeah, hmm. yeah. Uh, uh, Kevin. Answer. Yes. The one I was asking for. The one it's called I, Nick of Time. That is the one yep. with William Shatner. Yes. yes. Oh, it doesn't seem right. Okay, five points for this team. We're going to stop right here and wait, start wait. taking scores. Did, did you type it in? Your thing's not working if you did because it's not showing up. Yeah, it's doing that weirdness again. 
that weirdness. Okay, hold on. I got. Yeah. I just get refreshed. We're in the twilight zone, Susan. Weird. Okay, can you see it now? No. No. Well, we you people, I can see it straight right there at it. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, but that's because it's your computer. It's wrong. It's something wrong with the it sharing. Now awesome with your computer. computer. Okay, now can you see it? There you go. Yes. It's a miracle. We're alive. Oh my God. Notify Time to rewatch Dr. Strangelove. We are Seven. now live. We are no longer Memorex. Seven. Oops. Okay, can my... you see that? Yeah. Okay, thank yep. you very much. Yes. All right, so somebody at the 20s. So why, white seniors except Robin from the four corners of the earth. Five. <laughs> we got five twos, so don't be embarrassed. I'm not somebody, that embarrassed. Somebody gets four, I'll be embarrassed. All right, so this one, we know they got 10 because they're all stuck up and they have to talk about it. <laughs> 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 I was just on that team, so I shouldn't say anything. Did okay. anybody not get 10? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's the next <laughs> one. I recall that happening one week when my team got three. So flowers <laughs> and butterflies, please. Did you, did you guys get 10? Nine. Oh, uh, okay when your team gets the No, the other guys didn't get it because they had both have, bosses. but they didn't believe me whether it was teenage well. Yeah, we should we should have deferred to Deborah. Even though I, I never saw closely it. at the I picture. Think I, saw any. I got that one. Jacket. I got that one and I've never seen the school jacket. I thought it was a Michael J. Fox movie, so I'm glad I was taught that about And and I my team my team had the respect for black and white. No way, he's way too young. That was a remake. Teen Teen uh, Werewolf was a Teen Wolf. Wolf was a remake. Teen Wolf. Teen Wolf. I was a teenage Ooh, werewolf. We're last Michael place Landon again. Was Michael Ooh. Landon. Ooh. We need more. Oh, I shouldn't say it. All right. I, I, I wasn't believed. <laughs> I didn't even hear you suggest it. So it wasn't that I didn't believe you. I never heard you say it. <laughs> Monster movies. Michael Landon is dead. <gasps> and people <laughs> know it. That's Michael. That's not a bonus question. Generational, if people refer to him as um, Little you know, John. Little Joe. Little Joe. Joe. Bonanza. Little Joe. Little Joe right, or Pa. Or, or Pa. Or pa. Yeah. Yep. Oh, my God. Little Joe, Little Joe or Pa. Was he the an angel in some TV show, too? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Oh. Was it Touched by an Angel? Was that the name yeah. of it? Highway to Heaven. Yeah. Or no, yeah, Highway to Heaven. Touched by an Angel was the other one. Heaven, yeah. That was that was a stupid show, but Bonanza was awesome. Oh, we didn't do our we didn't come back from our break and do anything. Okay, so let me do this really quick before we go over to Isabella. So Mark is going to be doing a, anybody in the Salinas ish area is going to be doing a magic show tomorrow. It's going to be so much fun at a, at a Mexican restaurant we go to all the time. So cool. that's fun for anybody who's going to be there to in Salinas area. And everybody's supposed to watch Blues Brothers, and the only one person here, Alan, did his homework. So I want you guys all to watch Blues Brothers. And Alan highly recommends and, and kill and kill two hours perfectly. It's the good best hours. thing in the world. You'll never get him back. <laughs> Kyle, what do you got coming up? We double ship this week. Two episodes of Data Skeptic, both on our little right. topic of clustering. One about uh, how they clustered particular... the shows. Get it? Yes, <laughs> that's why there's two of them. Uh, yeah. We got one about how banks can use this algorithm to cluster their customers, and another where uh, we talked to somebody who came up with a separate algorithm to help people explain the results of a uh, K-means clustering algorithm. So, more deep into this famous clustering algorithm this week on Data Skip. Clustering. That's, cool. that's great. Cluster. Anyway, uh, Richard Saunders is having his 700th episode mm -hmm. this, this week coming up. Does wow. Adrian have a segment on it? He does. Right. And she does. It's going to be on numbers, probably the number 700. Okay. How did you get yes. that? You're society. psychic. I, just like I'm psychic. Um, <laughs> episode 701. Susan is actually a psychic. <laughs> well, I got the five, five, five ones. He mm, swears to me to amazing. this day. Every once in a while, he writes to me and he'll say, it really was five, five, five. I really didn't do it. I promise. I'm like, mm -hmm. um, uh -huh. uh, what else is coming up next week? I might not be here, but we have a plan in, in order to, to make it happen. You're so, going to deputize uh, Rob. 
Well, Rob. if I if Rob. I'm not here, if I'm not going to make it here, I'm going to give the password and everything to Rob, and you guys will sign on, and he'll be able to record it on his own computer and blah blah blah. So that will happen. I may or may not be here. If I'm not here, I will still need to have people who are going to do their little categories. So next week, all I have is nobody. So everything's open. I, Let's see, out. I can I do one. Carl raising his hand. His little hand. I think Deborah's got her hand up. Is that right? Oh, no, 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 no. Not really. I'll do, I'll do one, Susan. Okay, Robin's going to do one. I'll do New England states if anybody cares. I love doing the state. <laughs> no, 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 no. no, I don't want to do it, though. Gail, is that your hand? I thought I saw it again. God, I'm always ready to do it, but I'd rather do it the week after. Okay, she wants to do. She wants to do for um, Pi Day with Avi, and I better write down Pi Day is right there. So we have Carl and Robin. It's going to be very short. <laughs> I'll, I'll ask you again in a minute while you think about it amongst yourselves. Okay, so. We are going to go to so, Isabella. Hey, hey, I got one thing. So oh, I talked Rob's about got it last something? week. But yeah, so it's my interview with, I'll put it in oh, the yeah, chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I made a tiny URL because that's what's going to be read on the Skeptic Zone. So if anybody wants to watch this live and uh, you can ask questions via the Zoom, that's the registration um, URL at the bottom there. Oh, fantastic. Already make sure ready. I'm there. Oh, oh. can, you, can you make it? that an actual URL? Because we can't click on it that way. Um, you can copy and paste it to a web browser. Uh, it's just the I, bottom part. I, I like okay. copy. Oh, what, the three dots? Let me try right, So I have to copy the whole thing? Okay. Let me try it. Colon slash slash. <laughs> HTTP S. I think actually I'm not sure. Becky, about that. did you get permission work? to go out of yeah. town? I'll put I it with an ask. Tell me if that works. Yeah, I, I just did it. All right, four years. There you go. Um, Back. Yeah, that um, worked. They say you don't have to put a period after it. Okay. Hey, last bonus question: What's the monster in my photo? Where are you? What's his where? Name? Green, green, green monster. Wait, where are you? Next uh, to the, green the green, mo the green shaped face green. next. Where the I'm, not sure. I'm not saying where you are. Oh, I'm talking. It's got oh, a yellow we're talking frame. About the last, oh, the last <clears throat> I don't know because okay. I'm on a different place on everybody's screen. Yeah. If I'm Something talking, to it's do yellow with or the red female. Socks. Something to do with yeah. the oh. it's a green monster. It's green a Muppet. Monster. The green He's monster. He's the official yeah. mascot for the Boston Red Sox. Wally the Green Monster. He's supposed to live in the wall. Wally. Wally. Oh, because of the wall. Oh. The okay, so that's 11 o'clock. On the nineteenth, are we going to get baseball this year? What? Oh no! Yet. Let's hope not. I hope yeah. they get boycott the. What's game eleven o'clock on the nineteenth? So oh, you're talking about my thing. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Specific 11 time, eleven o'clock. Yeah. Um, Two o'clock East Coast time. There was something else I was saying. What was it? So, I for people who don't know about Havana syndrome, look okay. at the Wikipedia article on it, just for a little, <laughs> you know, a teaser, so you see what's going on. That's right. Oh, Rob. So I am probably going to be in Washington, D.C. Washington? Yes. Mark? At the end of April, I will finally receive the award that I won. Yes, I saw that. Great. <laughs> they kept saying, should we mail it to you? And I kept saying, <laughs> no, I will come there. And so they've got a they've got a dinner for me nice. and a lecture. So my dinner is going to be on oh. April the probably 27th and my Lecture is probably going to be on the 30th or something like that. So I'll be in Washington, D.C. for a while. I'm trying to arrange to go to other places and give talks. And Kitty Biddle was going to ask if I could go speak to in person to, to the uh, Philadelphia group. Oh, look who's coming. Here comes Leonard. So what, wait, what, what day of the week was it? I don't know. I haven't. It's, it's at the end of April. So I could, you know, I could go and go in May, early May. Will so you be anywhere in New, New, New York City? Well, so the other idea was to go to Buffalo to go to uh, Center for Inquiry. That's a trip. And uh, but I fly or I take a train or something. I don't care. And then um, if there was other groups that were going to be doing some, there is a New York City skeptics if they wanted to have me. But it'd have to be an in-person thing where I'd have a group of people coming. They'd like pay we for it. We're four hours away, Susan. And four, four and a half hours away. Why don't you guys just have me down in your area and put on a put on a talk in person? Do you do in-person talks? Yeah, we are. 
well, like that could happen if you ask and you arrange it. So, yeah. Well, a different topic, but I'll be in New York City that weekend, the end of April, not certain on the date yet, to at a nightclub to photograph. Remember I told you? uh, Yoko Ono and the the kids and other rock stars were going to be at a nightclub for a fundraiser. Well, I need to be in D.C. for the for the days that they have. Yeah, but I'm not sure the date yet either, though. So I I'm, I can either come out earlier and go to wherever or I can come out later and stay later. I mean, I I'm retired. I can do what I please. So I just have to have range before I go. But anyway, if somebody's got a place that wants to do live things and have me come and talk and that kind of thing. Anyway, so we're ready to go with Isabella, who's probably falling asleep at this point. Hi, Leonard. Oh, where's Leonard going to be? Leonard's going to be on my team. Yes, yeah. he's getting Leonard. James, Carrie, Kevin, Vincent, and Gail. You are now <laughs> on the team called Our Answers Are Stuck in the Ship Due to Supply Chain Issues, which is in the not doing so well. Right which now. is a very accurate reflection of our score. <laughs> they have the, the lowest score the is 19 and the highest is 29 so you got that's a spread of, yeah a bit okay we so, get them all and they get zero we could tie isabella bella 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 is easy bella bella bella, 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 bella. okay so i'm going to post the questions at the end um after i say it so yeah um okay so my category is on, um, you know, the famous guy. I don't know if you've heard of him. His name is Vladimir Putin. Um, oh, that's my category. But the category is called. gave up Putin for Lent, though. The so. category is called what he's famous on TikTok for right now, which is this category is called Vladdy Daddy. Because that's what's <laughs> running on TikTok right now. That's what, that's, what, that's what everyone of my generation is calling this guy right now. I don't know why. I don't get the hype. They're also currently obsessing over uh, the president of Ukraine right now. So oh, he's cool. No, that guy's hot. Not sure what's up with that, but I mean, you know, we love that. Okay. So question number one is. Uh, the muting old. in three, two, one. Yeah. You're, Isabella, you have to unmute. We're good. Okay. <laughs> question number one. How old is Vladimir Putin as oh. of 2022? Like right now, as of this moment, or yeah. not? Well, how old? I don't need the, the just like how old is he? Okay, there you go. Yeah, right, right now. now. Yeah, right now. He's still alive, right? Yeah, he's yeah. still alive. <laughs> okay, where did he go to college? No, wait, sorry. Wait, no, no, no. wait. Where was he born? That's what I want to know. Sorry, where was he born? I'll take the current name for the town slash country or the previous name for the town slash country. That's number two. The third one is, where did he go to college? Number four is, what government organization was he a part of before coming president? Number five, true or false, he offered help to the US after the 9-11 terrorist attacks. Question number six, what is his religion? Question number seven, who named him deputy chief administrator to of the to the Kremlin? Number eight, who was poisoned with polonium under Putin's orders allegedly in 2006? And number nine, how many terms has Putin served as president? And how many countries were formerly part of the USSR? Oh, very good. We should know these things, you guys. Uh, Me copy. Uh, the religion one. The, the religion one. Are are you just, uh, you know, uh, the difference I, between I don't uh, know the if you Greek should be gods questions. and the Roman gods, or I don't know. Do you want a particular sect of the? <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, that's I can't answer that. Ooh. Okay. Here, wait. The que- wait. The numbers didn't transfer over. Let me just edit this and then. Sorry. (laughs) 
do need clarification on number four, though. I mean, yes. You have, to, you have to do your pacing. Oh, come on, Rob. You don't need to ask that question. I, even I know the answer to that. Well, it, it's like yeah, imme immediately clear. before, or is what he's known for? Known for. This is. Like, well, this I is want TikTok. Isabella to say that. Come on now. This isn't the deep study on his history. Hmm? I knew that was going to happen to at least one of these. This is TikTok. I want to remind you that I am a busy nursing student who doesn't have time too. for the small little details. Thank you. What is his astrological sign? Oh my God. How, how relevant is it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what his astrological sign is. <laughs> okay, there That's we go. Probably okay. Cancer. Everyone yeah. <laughs> probably is, truth be told. Anyways, all off to your break your breakout rooms. Have fun. Enjoy. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Have fun. Oh, I'm going to mine too. Oh, I got to send Leonard. Leonard's got to go to his breakout room. Go to send Leonard to his breakout room. He's going to wear three. Tell me, Susan. Um, In this case, tell him. He's going to three. I'll, I'll go where you send me. You're going to three. And I'm going to four. Bye. Bye, Susan. Don't mess up my team. Thank you. I'll try not to. Hello. Okay, Isabella told me, don't mess up my team. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I write down 58 but i don't know for sure i think it's oh, close to that he's he's close to my age yeah yeah uh i wrote like 69 or 70 we don't have a tolerance no he's that. not that old all right Thank you. Uh, where was he born i think he's from st petersburg yeah leningrad or st petersburg oh that's interesting i didn't there's know a, that. There's, there, there's a helpful hint in the way she asked the question yeah. yeah, but I think someone actually told me that the other oh, day. Oh, what'd she say? She you said can name either its current or or the name of the, its name at the time he was born there. Oh, I'm not looking at that. Right. Time. So it was St. Petersburg, then it was Leningrad, then it, it changed it back again. Sort of like the Awani, you know? Yeah. Where did he go to college? That I don't know. Don't know. I don't know if it's called Main College where he was born. Monsters Incorporated. Yeah! <laughs> Monsters Inc. Put that down. I want to say it's probably in Europe somewhere, but yeah, he does speak English. He does speak English pretty well. Yeah, yeah but they don't show him because he doesn't want to have looked like he doesn't. Right. I should know this. Okay, and he was associated with the KGB. Yeah. And was he around in 9-11? Uh, I think he was because he came from Gorbachev was yeah. follow the person before him Gorbachev no there was uh, Yeltsin between Gorbachev oh. and him yeah right Yeltsin well to be clear but those are different positions Gorbachev was the last leader yes. of the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics Boris Yeltsin was president of Russia even while Gorbachev was head of the USSR right so was he who was Putin in charge <coughs> during 9-11? Yes. Um, yeah, he's been around a while. He's on his fourth, he's on his fourth uh fourth term. Um, I wrote down four or five. I think I remember. think he I think he offered help. Yeah, I kind of do too. I think so. Because you know, yeah. In fact, I think if it's if I'm not mistaken. Didn't we get really insulted by something about who was it that offered America help? With? It might have been Russia, but it wasn't 9 11. But somebody offered us help and we're like, thanks, but no thanks. It was oh, something about during a recession or something. Yeah, something that was really embarrassing. Oh, do you need help? It was <laughs> uh, like, shut the heck up, you know. Um, okay, so his religion is he Catholic? Roman Catholic? I would say Russian Orthodox. Yeah, I would think so. But I'm, I, but I. That's just a guess. I don't know for a fact. I think he's an atheist. I, I kind of do too. I think like he, he may not admit probably. it, though. He may well, not but publicly. officially, what is his religion? I don't think officially so, he's. So an atheist. two things. I don't, One, I'm I think a, he's Russian Orthodox, and two, uh, technically, atheist isn't a re religion except by certain legal definitions in the U.S. Right. 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 Yeah. Well, I would say, in the sense, I, I actually wrote down N.A. Because I didn't think he had, a but on the other hand, 
I don't think he would publicly not have a religion. Right. No, definitely not. And yeah. if he's gonna if he's gonna lie about a religion, it would be the religion of his people, Russian Orthodox. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And who named? It? I think he named himself deputy chief administrator. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Well, could it have been Yeltsin? I oh. guess. Could have been Yeltsin. Yeah. Yeah. Because that was. I mean, who else was around? That's, that's the only guess I have. Okay. Deputy chief administrator. Let's see, so he's ten years younger. So he wouldn't have been. You wouldn't have been around in Khrushchev days. No. No. That's a long time ago. So a long time ago. Yeah. Well, two thousand poisoned in two thousand six. Was it that a man and his daughter? And, yeah. Be I, isn't that more recently? No. no. His running the his um the person that was running against him, but that was not Navalny. It was just a few he, years ago. No, oh he, yeah, that was just really recently. Was that that's Lit, Litvinenko. Yeah. Yeah. Can you pronounce spell that? Um, I okay. think the spelling is L I T V I N E N K O, but I'm not. I wouldn't bet money on that. I will just wait. Spelling. Close enough. I think you're probably. Pretty close. I think, think four years or four terms, rather. I think so. I think it's four. Yeah. I think I got the questions in the wrong order. So is oh. is it number one? Is how old is he? And we're saying what? I don't know. I don't know. I, what did we collectively decide? I was thinking late fifties, but no, seven fifty-eight. Okay, if he served four terms, how old? How long are his terms? Four years or more? Well, I think now he's made them indefinite no well i think he still, has, a, he still has an election but he'll he'll be in power one way or the other until somebody forcibly removes him from power right yeah, so, he, he, he just he changed the rules right he made yeah, it right. Yeah. yeah yeah i think more like 65 or something i don't really? know could be. Could be. he looks he looks pretty old oh, I, I think he's older than 58 too okay that could be my, my guess was like 69 or 70 69. no he is no way close to that okay I'd go with 65 or 66. I think yeah. he's closer to 62. I think he's very young. <laughs> he's well, not we, never, young. we never got down to number 10. Okay, number one, how, how old are we saying he is? I'm just a guest here, so I do not get, it's not my, I'm just here to mess you guys up and make you challenge everything you say and then ruin your scores. <laughs> I do it equally to everybody, so I'd say sixty-five. Okay, sixty-five. Okay, sixty-five. Jane has made an executive decision. Okay. I like it. We okay. did we did we even do number ten yet though? How many countries no, we were didn't. part of the former? And on ten, there's does she mean how many Soviet socialist republics were they were there, or how many countries were part of the overall Warsaw Pact controlled by the USSR? I think that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I. I Part uh, of, yeah. A lot. I, I, I suspect she means how many social Soviet socialist republics were there. And what's the not answer? How many nations were under the Carl, umbrella what's the of the Warsaw Pact? Carl. That answer would be 15 Soviet socialist republics. Okay, so write that down. Now, the answer to the other one that you asked is what? So we'll just have both. Uh, uh, the, the answer to that other one is more difficult and depends at what point in time you're talking about. 27. Because... Didn't she say there are this times is where Czechoslovakia, from... Yugoslavia? She's coming in right now. You can ask her. Would or wouldn't? Carl, well, she's she's like this is what all the kids are talking about on TikTok. It is so actually, yes. Yeah, so... Number ten. Mm -hmm. Are you asking how many Soviet socialist republics were there in the USSR, or how many countries how many were there in the current Warsaw countries Pact? now in 2022 were formerly part of the USSR? Well, that's a different question also none of these questions are meant to be confusing okay <laughs> carl could you repeat number Wait, two the you, option for number two that you should be part of the ussr for number two no no, no, no. Your, your second option oh well my first option was how many soviet socialist republics were there second yeah. option would simply be how many countries were under the warsaw pact 
which I don't think is what she's asking for. Um, um, I'm basically asking for how many countries. What was your fir- the, your first question? That that was what I meant. Okay. How, how how many Soviet socialist republics were there when it was the USSR? Yes. And okay. the answer is fifteen. Yes. That that if that's I remember what I'm asking for. Okay. I'm so, sorry. I didn't right. mean. You might want to ask. Make sure everybody knows that question. So. Yeah, Carl, you're the only person people that have asked for that. So well, because I haven't got to ten. Carl, write it down or something so that I. Fi- fi- finally, the fact that that my geography teacher made us memorize every single one of the fifteen Soviet socialist republics has paid off. Uh-huh. Carl, Carl, <laughs> could you write it down in the chat so that I could, so I could write it in the questions correctly because I'm not sure. Sure. Do you guys hear that I had a dream about Carl? We all went to his house and we we were we were sleeping all over the house and we went shopping for curtains. <laughs> I think we might have gone to a grocery store too, probably because we had a lot of people there to eat and we had to go find food. <laughs> I don't know why, but nice to know that you're being dreamed about, Carl. <laughs> yeah, thanks for hosting us. Yeah, it was really yeah. sweet of you. We had a lot of good. I don't think really we know anybody time. else in your area. And the it cat was, was on me. I, th- I think we all got to know your cats. <laughs> Maybe that was the point. I get the couch where Carl's sleeping right there. I get the 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 smiley face. That's where my head goes. Couch with power recliners. Ooh. 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 That sounds dangerous. And Deborah has has spent the night with me many times on our mm-hmm. travels. Yes. Uh, and it's hilarious. <laughs> What's hilarious? <laughs> Wait a minute. Deborah and I always have to share the bed. That's hilarious. So she did goes, you have she any guests for number three? She says, of where went are you college? alive, Susan? Oh. Are you still alive? <laughs> True. <laughs> we wake up in the morning. Do you think it's a British school? Dead. Um, Would you Either, pick one of the... Well, I don't know if you're British or... Maybe which some, other Oxford? Which other, he went to Oxford. Did he actually? <laughs> I don't know. Cambridge. Well, let's put Oxford. There are other schools in Europe. I mean, there are also schools what, in Russia. Right, and what did he study at? We don't know the names of any of them. He's a KGB agent. Wouldn't he stay in Russia? No. He wasn't then when he was a you know. What what was his specialty? What 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 was he? Was was he a lawyer? Like is no. he trained? I don't know what it is now. Training. Espionage. <laughs> Propaganda. Trained terrorist. Yeah, for real. Mass madman. Should we say? I, I don't know. Well, we got Actually, I don't seven know. seconds. Somebody's got to know. Well, Oops. let's just pick a school then. Oxford. Okay. Fine. It'll be Cambridge. And for four, I am hoping she wants KGB and not the FSB. It is KGB. If and you've already FSB, and you just still, said it. Still, if you she just says said FSB, it, Carl. we're still getting the point. Yeah, we're still getting the point. That's the way it is. Same thing anyway. Basically. It's not like we're showing anybody your point. <gasps> Susan. But we are recording this. We are nobody we are. nobody's watching it, so that's okay. Hi, people watching. <laughs> Hi, no, no. Hi, person watching. Oh. About 10 people, 12 people. Or, Hi, Susan. Remember when you recorded this and I told you you were going to be the only one watching it? I've actually watched put in your comments. of one before. You I did? actually did. Somebody put it in the comments that you heard this part, okay? That's how <laughs> I would know. That's how we'll know. Bye, everybody. Good job. That was that was a great idea for us to do this today, Isabella. I Thank you. know any of this yeah. stuff. I I hope everyone learned something. I I learned a lot, but I have a question that wasn't asked. Does anybody know what he was trained as? I mean, what is his, don't say madman. What his major was? He's not, he's not, what is his, does he have an expertise in like? I think he was, he was he was a a painter. No, he was a lawyer. He was a lawyer. Was he? He went to law school. He went to law school. Oh, Oh, so that's what they, that's what, uh, uh, Wilma said, but I wasn't sure. Yeah, uh, I was doing you can claim no him in the legal movies. community. Those oh. dang lawyers. Damn lawyers. I almost used his face in the, the monster thing for the bonus. Name <laughs> when I was well, we didn't have a movie. Name them in. When I was doing research on this, um, I used uh, 
I kind of went down a rabbit hole on, yeah. um, on actually on a, oh my goodness, on um, Britannica, on Putin and just the whole history. So Ooh, that took me about a good hour and a half of my day. People are going to be like, you be like, actually, let me tell you. Yeah. About so I use Britannica. So that's a very trusted website. So yeah. It's not like, it, all my not like Wikipedia where all the trolls are. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's it's off of Britannica, which we are supposed to use for our research for school stuff. Yeah. So, yeah. Do, do okay. you realize that the Wikipedia site of the uh, which is called Reliability of Wikipedia actually has a lot of citations which say it's just as accurate as Britannica? Ah, there's it's actually more. more. Look that up. Look that up. It's actually more, especially okay. about psychics and things. Yeah, well, so, yeah, that's true. At least All right. it was. It was. Okay, let's see. Let me pull this up. All right. So for question number one, how old is Vladimir Putin or Vladdy Daddy, as we like to call him? Yeah, it's called he, Vladdy Daddy. <laughs> he's 69 years old. Really? No. Is I would pl- not have thought plus so. or minus. Do we have a plus or oh. minus on this? No. <laughs> I thought he was no. way younger. Softer. If Jeff, he was he's... a horse, he'd be 70. <laughs> So yeah, uh, and if he was a horse's ass, what would he be? I did not think exactly he was that. He is. 35? He that I thought he was All my friends keep currently making jokes because he's 69. Ha, ha, ha. So oh, my God. What a funny joke. I've never heard that joke before. Oh, Can somebody wow. explain that to me? <laughs> Isabel, no. I'm sure you know that. No. I'll we tell you later what a 68 you. is, Susan. We can't explain <laughs> it to you, Susan. Yeah. <laughs> I can. I can. That's, that's what you want. You want a 68. We, we can explain it, but you have to stand on your head. And I can't be. Explain, whatever it takes. Okay, go for it. I'm really surprised. Okay. With Anyways. inflation, I'd settle for 64. <laughs> Anyways, number two. He was born in Leningrad, USSR, or now St. Petersburg, Russia. I'll take either answer. Very good. Yeah. Georgia. Petrograd. Yes. Okay. I number knew th- that, but I... My team knew it. Uh, I would never have gotten it. Question number three, or did you go to college? He studied law at Leningrad State University. I, uh, I told you guys. <laughs> I said, why don't we just pick the place uh, where he I said he Leningrad. Oh, I didn't hear you yeah, say that. Did, I Rob, might have agreed with you it. on that one. So I according said, to said, the... According to the Wikipedia article, he also got a PhD from the St. Petersburg Mining Institute. Mm. Very cool. Very cool. Is that, is, okay. that a, is that a psychic organization? No, that's where he got the polonium. Polonium. Mm. <laughs> they learned it so they, they, you can't mine polonium. Oh. He Anyways, doesn't need to mine it. It's Putin. It's a joke. Lottie. Lottie dead. <laughs> Question number That's four. A very good one, Faith. That was good. <laughs> question number uh, answer, yeah, question number four. What government organization was he a part of? He was part of the KGB. Somebody recruited him for it. I don't know. There's a lawyer. They said, "Hey, you look I mean, like it's, you have it's no conscience, and you have it's Putin. Who hey, you're knows? a son of a bitch? How'd you like to work for us? <laughs> yeah. no. I, 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 I really don't know the background. Are you a sociopath? The KGB? He's, he's, he's a sociopath, a and your face your face doesn't move. Do you want to? He still thinks he's in the KGB. Doesn't... That's the it's, problem. It's you uh, both a certain moral ambiguity. Yeah, he was actually very connected because his grandfather was a was a cook. And cooked for Stalin and Lenin. Ooh. Really? Ooh. Ooh. So yeah, I saw it down the Wikipedia page. Got that family connection. But you you see why he why Trump was no match for that guy. I mean, <laughs> this guy goes way back. Yeah, because Trump can't a spell dead P-H. dead cat is no <laughs> is, is uh, <laughs> better than Trump. He can't spell PhD. That's a good one. Okay. Okay. Question number five: True or false? He offered help to the U.S. after the 9/11 terrorist attacks that's true he did. I have so. <laughs> very good susan i got one well i mean my team agreed with me but still <laughs> question number six what is his religion he is orthodox christian russian orthodox yeah yeah we yeah. think he's an atheist <laughs> I mean, uh, he was a Lubavitcher, <laughs> he was a Lubavitcher but he cut off. Actually, I honestly girl. think he got excommunicated from the church, but I'm not 100% on that. 
I read that on TikTok, so don't like quote me on it. <laughs> oh, that's reliable. Oh, wow. <laughs> slightly less than uh, Britannica. So. Okay, um, number seven. Who named him deputy chief administrator of the Kremlin? Um, he was named deputy chief administrator of the Kremlin under Boris Yeltsin. Yes. Yay. Yay. Wow. I'm amazed we did this good. Question number Yeltsin, eight. It must have been somebody else. In. Uh, 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 uh. Gosh, number- you guys, we should all stay at Carl's house. We could get these jokes all night. <laughs> Dash question up. number eight. Question number eight: Who was poisoned with polonium under Putin's orders in 2006? Alexander Livinenko. I say poison because yes. they're never gonna freaking admit to it. I mean, the guys who did it got an award for services to the fatherland. Somebody please put that in the chat so I know how to spell it. <coughs> okay, that's uh sure yeah. we I'll, I'll copy the spelling, all these over. Yeah, okay, this that's is fine. done. So we answered something that started with an L and ended with an Inko. I think that should count. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no. Nobody's looking at your paper, Peggy. Uh, okay. yeah, how we did, we didn't actually get the right answer. The guy who came Our back and was arrested is in Inko. prison now in Siberia. That guy. We we okay. know who it was. We just butchered his name really badly. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Um, question number nine, how many terms has Putin served? Four terms or 16 years? Yeah. Yay, good job. Ooh. I mean, boo, yay. Oh, I knew that. Um, how many countries were formerly part of the USSR or however Carl free phrased it? How many Soviet me? socialist republics were there under the USSR? Yeah. So it's 15. Yes. Oh, 15. Um, ah. I have so 15. And- but I don't think so you'll read it out. So I'll thank you, Mr. Comments. Craven. Thank you, Karen. Karen stuck to her guns. Carl's we, under fingers. We, we great missed it teacher by, made we him missed it by oh. that much. Freshman geography. One. One, huh? There are all of the... Oh, there's the countries. Yep. If we had gotten a couple more right, we would have got a 10. <laughs> <laughs> more than a couple. So thank you all. Thank you all very much. I had a very fun time doing this category. Actually, um, that was great. You. That was a good one. And I did thought, you know, we're all going to listen with this horrible person who yeah, might start World War III. So enjoy. Oh, yeah. How, you, how are you enjoying your first first uh, World War III? I don't know. I'll let you know. Um, there's currently been a bunch of Air Force recruiters outside the nursing building lately. Oh, no. So oh. I'm not saying I'm planning on joining, but if it gets really, really bad, I mean, it's a free degree so we'll see Ooh. anyways that's where we're at <laughs> what I, thought. I wonder yeah i guess the, the army i mean the all the military probably goes hey, i joined the yeah. air force over any other group but yeah it's a or great Navy. life Navy it's a great though. life i was raised in it and you get to travel the world yeah so and you if can it be gets a nurse really still. really bad but it won't be so much yeah, fun when, when the world is then nuclear, i'll go work in a field uh, hospital in like ukraine yeah. and you I'll I'll be doing trivia from you from the from Ukraine. So that would be actually knows. pretty exciting. I have what? a nephew who was in the Air Force. He's missing both legs. Okay, thank you, thank you. She Gina. would be my, a nurse. My, son, my son's in South Korea right now, and he's only been there for a year, and his school loan is half paid off already. Yeah, my dad well, was like, "Hey, you're going to save money," and I'm like, "All right, thanks." Isabella, well, oh. that's not very attractive. Jamie and I have a sister who joined the Air Force because she wanted to see the world and end, and not be a secretary and spent the entire time she was in the military in a one person office as a secretary in Mississippi. Oh, oh man. Oh, man. Yeah. And I know someone who is now 28 years old and has broken his back and mm. is pretty much done with the things that he really wanted to do with his life. Makes sense. Was he in the Air Force? Well, or just somebody you knew. He flew. He flew. Yeah. Um, she would be yeah. a nurse, you guys. Not a and boy, are her arms tired. You don't get to Anyways, they tell you. All my other friends are either blind. You don't get any guarantees of how you're going to serve. <laughs> well, it'd be a <clears throat> medical thing. All right. Well, let's yeah. get our scores. Oh, wait, that was wait, speaking, really- speaking of the military, in the State of the Union address, it's the first time I ever heard of these burn site things. Has anyone heard? Oh, of this I've before? never heard of that before. <laughs> and I'm really? wondering. No, I never heard of this. And I'm wondering because Bartholomew talks about all of the previous things like Gulf War syndrome or whatever being largely psychological um, and, and the symptoms they were talking about it, well, except for the cancer. I'm wondering if any of that is that too. So I don't you'll know. be able to ask him this question. Soon. I will. I actually will. On the 19th at 11 a.m. Pacific time. 
but I had never heard of that. And there was a lot of yeah, controversy about that being brought up in the thing because it was like, what, where are you going with this? But it burns yeah, and, and, and did you hear Bobart shout out what she shouted out? Those little moment? traitors, you mean? Those pieces of scummy, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, whatever. How do you really feel about them, Susan? Oh, you know, just, I, I, I don't know anything about it. Wearing the bright red little, anyway let's do our scores <laughs> and that was not a glitch in the video okay so we will start here with our answers are stuck on a cruise ship on a ship due to supply chain issues and let's see if their answers are still stuck six six okay and then white seniors, how'd you do, white people? Four. Four. Yeah, four. Somebody needs four. to go study their Putin. I'm, I'm counting four. Okay, time to rewatch Dr. Strangelove. Do you have a moment to tell us how you know about what you know about Putin? Six. Seven. What do you? Eight. Nine. <laughs> I got nine, nine, nine. Going on. Two. Going on. I, I apologize. Yeah, it's You're six. right. Six. six. I'm sorry. She got all excited. Um, and then oh, let's ask. Apology accepted. Okay, flowers and butterflies, which is my team, and Isabella. Eight. Before you guys all went to your break, I mean, we went into our rooms. Isabella made me promise I would not mess up her team. <laughs> Do you see that? Eight? That's because I was on that team. I don't know how. It, when people I'm watch the video, cursed. people can watch the video and listen to you talk about the age thing. Thank you, Susan. Well, we didn't get the age right either. We let Jane pick, so it's her fault. <laughs> Why are you blaming poor Jane? Because nobody wanted to pick a year. What did she do? <laughs> <laughs> she picked 65. All right. Giving up Putin for Lent. You guys should Nine. have a high score. There you go. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. Nine is awesome. Wow. wow. Oh, yeah. cool. Good job. That, that'd be good. That'd be good. So I think there's a there was a ringer in there. Very good. Commies. It was a it was a yeah, team it was collaboration. Collaboration. So thank you. Mostly Isabella. Karen and, and I love that you're playing. I love that you're Can someone say commie? Commie. Commie. Comrade. Comrade. I, Susan, can I share my screen for a second? I want to show you a uh a thing based on what we were just talking about. Yeah, sure. As long as, should I stop the video? No. It be recorded. Okay. You don't need to. It can be recorded. Ready? Mm -hmm. Left me. Uh, That's funny. <laughs> oh, <laughs> those are those are Over to the right. The, the, the two. Uh, Cute. The yeah. two people heckling during the State of the Union. God, look at them. I mean, look at those people. What, yep. Green what kind of people are no, they? No, look at the guy behind him. He's had enough of their shit. And you can just tell that just must be part of it. He his had thing. to say, I mean, the, what are, who, how disrespectful. You know, I was thinking of people who didn't show up to go to the State of the Union. You think about it. Well, one how of them. How jaded was... are you? How jaded are you that you don't go to the state? How many State of the Unions do you get in your lifetime that you can go and actually? The sit girl from Rhode Island, Island couldn't go. Who? Bernie Sanders didn't go. Yeah, he was busy to go to MSNBC right after. Yeah, he was. He was. I was like, how did they get Bernie over here so quickly? He, he was, he was at, Bernie. He also <laughs> went to to uh, um, Stephen Colbert. No, yeah, that's where I saw him. Stephen Colbert. I was like, live. I. I Colbert's in New York. I figured they just stuck him on a like a oh, plane. It's Gina Raimondo was the uh, designated survivor. Well, they, I was like, how did he get from Washington D.C. to New York so quickly? And I thought they put him on a plane, but he he they probably he, did. But fast. earlier than that, he's a Concord getting go that fast, right? But I thought it was right at the th anyway. But come on, man, I'd go see. I don't care who is the president. I'm going to go. Gina Raimondo could not go because she was the designated survivor. Oh, he was. oh, Gina Raimondo, the Rhode Island Ooh. person. So. And see, he knows it because you guys should know these things because we did Rhode Island already. Susan, do you want to be the designated survivor? So what? what she position? is next week. I don't what, know about that. What position she is next is hers? Week. She might what, not be what's here. Our, what's our position in the government? Uh, what? Woman. What are you talking what? about, Rob? Top person if they get wiped out. Person who was in the designated survivor. Who was that? 
Rhode Island. A woman no, in what Rhode Island. Rhode was in what this position time? is she? Who she was a House of Representatives. It has to be a cabinet member. I don't understand why. They have a member of cabinet and the members of the House and the Senate. Oh, okay. So well, they have Amy three. Amy is trying to answer you. I thought she was Secretary of Energy. She, she is. She was there. Probably, yeah, she is. Okay, I thought so the Secretary of Energy member. was there because they they panned to her during when he's talking about electric cars. I know that we're talking about on local radio why she wasn't there. Yeah, it has to be somebody in line of succession to the presidency. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know. Susan, well, I think you'd be a great designated. Thank you. Governors. Thank you, Isabella. If everybody dies, absolutely, I would be really great. <laughs> if everybody above me is dead. She's the Secretary of Commerce. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, Because they did okay. pan to the woman of energy. Okay, Robin. Robin. Okay. Robin's doing bonus. I hope you know you were doing bonus. I know. Okay. Oh, are you all ready? Is everyone ready? Go yes, Robin. and you even have your powers. Go I love that powers. you did Vladdy Daddy. That's just hilarious. Thank you. I thought I wanted to get a kick out of it. That that is very funny. Good category. Useful. Okay. All right. My my category is Vladdy Daddy. Similar. Ooh. Um, <laughs> there are seven countries which share a border with Ukraine. Your task is to name the seven for seven points. And for the remaining three points, name the capital city of any one of the seven. Oh, okay. Or so for a total of three capital cities to make 10. So we need all seven. And then we, we need all seven and you can get another three. You can three. Name three of the capitals of the seven that you have. That's good. Seen. That's good. Okay. What are you calling this category? Seven. Seven nation army. Nobody look in the chat because there are things in the chat that might give you away. Are there? Well, she put in the all the different uh, countries that were. Oh yeah. So don't look. Siento. Seven countries. We can't look at the chat. I think I think people are going to look at the chat. Well, don't look <laughs> at the chat with. I already, I already memorized set. it. Too late. <laughs> Okay, so <laughs> that's okay. You can look at the chat. That's not that helpful. It doesn't. It doesn't no. say uh, the seven. I mean, it's yeah, yeah. It's you have a fifty percent chance ahead, of getting. Go them. ahead, look at the chat. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. It's a trick. Don't fact, look. Fact, Don't look. Copy, it's a copy trap. down. Copy Don't down all up. those. Copy down all those countries. Don't look up. <laughs> yeah. Don't okay. Look. So, <laughs> James, I'm wrong. Canada. How about Canada? Send us to our rooms before we discuss it here. Oh, do I, well, I don't know how to do that. Oh, you don't know how to do that? I don't have I'm sending. powers. Okay, you need to learn how to do that. Okay, I've so I'm going before. to fly. I just am not aware of having powers. But Ooh, she has powers. The power now. What was that about? All right. Oh, Peggy, what the hell is on your head? Isn't it cute? <laughs> All right. It's the gesture of Ukraine. Okay. Well, I know I know one country. Belarus? Uh, Russia. Russia. Yeah. <laughs> Russia for sure. Belarus. Moscow. Moscow. Who's ready to Russia. Russia. Who's Poland. ready to I got him. I got Poland, Poland Belarus, Russia. Um, um Maldo is, Poland, is it Moldova? Does yes. Poland is that the side it's on? So Poland is a uh, neighbor? Well, yeah, they're all going been, to yeah. Poland. They're going to Poland. That's right. Yeah. That's right. So is uh, Germany? Is this Germany? No. No. Uh, Romania. Romania. Yeah, Romania. There's a bunch yeah, of Romania. Romania. It's kind of like on the other side of it. Romania's so, in between on the left side. Is, it, it's is there a stand? Do you think there's a Lithuania? Maybe. Bulgaria is right underneath Romania. Does it touch? Does it touch it? Yeah. Pakistan. Bulgaria. Or is it Bulgaria? Pakistan. across the water? Pakistan. Is that too far? No. Away? No, that's on the opposite side. Um, Bulgaria, yeah. it's right on the coast of the Black Sea. Bulgaria might. Bulgaria? I know uh, it's underneath any Romania. Any of the any of the Balkan countries? No. Oh, I, I don't know. think so. I on think the it's other too far side by the Crimea. Right Isn't Italy? No, it's too far to the west. It's on the other side of the water. What about Armenia? Is that possible? No, that's that's under Georgia. It's on the opposite Isn't side. India oh. right there? Like what about Georgia? No, no, Georgia is on the opposite side of the Black Sea. 
is on the east side of the Black Sea. Crimea is right down it's, here. So on the other side of Crimea, on the right hand side of Crimea, isn't that India? Or what oh, is that right way there? Way far. That's that's part of the far east. Well, then what's right on the other side of it of Crimea? England, Russia. <laughs> nope. Uh, could, could um, Turkey be anywhere in there? No, Turkey. Turkey is south. It's not, it's, Turkey is south of, of Georgia. Um, oh, it goes Russia all the way around like this. What are the stands? So there's Kazakhstan. Is there a Turkestan? Turkestan. Uzbekistan. I don't, think, I don't think any of them. Do we name all seven? Do we say do we say Lithuania? We said Belarus. How many do we have? Belarus for sure. Okay, we have Poland, Belarus, yeah. Russia, yeah. Moldova, Romania, and Bulgaria. Romania. Do we only need one more? Is Hungary? Well, Does Hungary border? It is might Finland be. in there somewhere? It doesn't. If Hungary... No, Finland's like far, far away. I think. Oh, well, Finland's Finland. way up. I, I, I knew it was. Up. I knew it was next to the Russia, but I didn't know. No, yeah, Finland's not way Russia, up. North, not, North Scandinavia, not Ukraine. Um, um, but what if Hungary? It's something they have a very small border. I think. Okay, if we go with Hungary, we have seven, and then we need yeah. capital cities. So Poland's capital city is. How many? Warsaw. Cap Warsaw. Hang on. How many capitals Warsaw. do you need? How many capitals three, do we three. need? Three. Warsaw. Well, we, well Warsaw. Three, Warsaw. Moscow. 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 Um, Bucharest. Bucharest, Romania. Yeah, Bucharest. Buc Bucharest. Uh, Sofia is um, Bulgaria. In, uh, Bulgaria. Yeah. I actually was there. I gave a talk. That's no. really um, I was in Romania on hold for, at the airport for three hours. Romania is a ship. For layover. Romania is the worst of the worst of the worst. We were there during the Ceausescu years. Oh, but that's a long time ago. But we were trying to say people were starving to death and we were chosen to um, fly into Romania with food to try to save some of the, oh, some of wow. our friends, some of our friends. So we smuggled food into Bucharest during the time of Ceausescu. What years was that? 1986. Yeah, oh. 80s. 85, 86. That's where they had the babies that were yeah, that all needed to be adopted all the time. They always yeah. were showing them on the 86. And what happened was people knew that we were not Romanian because our son was six months old and we took him with us in a stroller. There are no babies and there's no strollers in Romania at that time. So no everyone babies. knew that we were oh Western. My God. Yeah. It was dis it was disgusting. The starvation. The conspicuous wealth of your baby and a stroller. Oh. Who were you? Who were you? Who were you with when you did that? Well, we lived, we lived in Israel. We went actually as immigrants into Israel and we lived with many Georgians and a lot of Romanians and parents of Romanian friends of ours were starving to death in Romania. So they asked us to smuggle food from Israel and fly into Bucharest to save them. And well, did you oh, How much food could you get in there? You are a so what, we, we, what we did was we brought um, packages of, of peanuts because they had high protein, it's easy and compact. Mm -hmm. But most of the most of what we brought were bribes because the police they steal everything from you. So we had to buy we had to buy um, lots of um, cigarettes. The, the currency was Kent cigarettes. Oh my god! So we god. had to buy a lot of pack, the hard pack of cigarettes of Kent. Of all the things so, that you... that was the currency. It's the lay. We the lay we <laughs> but luckily, but we went in and we pretended to be um, diplomats of the UN, and that way we slid under this like doorway. Oh wow! Because otherwise, the police would have confiscated all the food we brought, and UN diplomats were exempt from the searches. So we slid and pretended we were UN diplomats, and we were exempt from having all of our goods stolen. So, so how did you have like a food to your friend? Them? It was horrible. We we contacted a friend, and what happened was it was in a back alley, and there's so many microphones along oh. the streets that uh, when we got there, we, we asked the mother. We said, "How could you, this country is horrible." She said, be quiet. We looked up and there was a microphone. There must have been 30 or 40 people who heard us and were chasing us in the alleyways to try to get whatever food we brought. It was terrible. Oh. We fled. We finally made it to our kind of hotel before um, people started stealing all of our goods. It was, it was awful. Take it was a horrible. Yeah, it was a horrible. We were there for a week until our bribes ran out. The police were stealing from us every day. Where are you talking about Romania? In the it sucked. Wow. I, to, oh, I went to Bulgaria. 86. I went to Bulgaria a few years ago, and it is the best internet ever I've ever seen. Mm. Germany's the worst, 
and Bulgaria was the best. And it's because their infrastructure is so brand new because they were so awful. They just rebuilt it. And so I thought Bulgaria was amazing. The people were fantastic. They took good care of me. It was really, really nice. And I went to a postage stamp museum all by myself. I was terrified because I was by myself and nobody speaks English. (laughs) There's a lot of non-English speakers over there. The newest countries that don't have an infrastructure have the most modern technology. That's why South Africa is the latest country to get color TV. Do you know that? Oh, I didn't know that. So, and they always said, why, why did um, South Africa s- s- spend such a long time getting color TV? And the reason why was because um, they wouldn't allow black and white on the same screen. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> An old South African. That thing. is really bad. I'm I'm really surprised. That, I'm surprised though that quality. Germany. I'm surprised that Germany doesn't have. Germany a is the there. worst Wi-Fi, <laughs> and they don't allow credit cards unless you're staying in a major hotel or something. You don't have. Really? You have to have euros, or you have to have one of their debit cards. But the country doesn't believe in people going into debt like Americans do. You know. Uh, I better tell Avi. Yeah, I better you tell. I better let Avi know. Tell tell yeah. Avi. I did tell know. Avi. I told him. Oh. Good job, everybody. All right. Yep. Very good. What? Yeah, there was one in kind of over by Hollister last time. It was Friday. We had an earthquake. Remember I we put one up earthquake? on Facebook the other day. Yeah. Well, that was that that. We, the, the job is to put as fast as you can what you think. The Hollister is. is a slow moving one. Her master sent me up there when I left Susan's house. Oh, yeah, she did. I drove to Hall. Hollister to see that slow shifting fault. Yep, you can find it. You can walk around and find I it. I did that. I yep. did that. There's a there's a um what is it called in the street? Like a sidewalk that was supposed yeah. to show it's it like really it, good. And somebody yeah. said somebody repaired that. It's like, no, that was a tourist destination. People <laughs> yeah. didn't do that, but but I couldn't find the house. <laughs> I, I, I live here and I didn't even go over. We went there when I was in college and our geology class went on a bus over there and walked around. Exactly. That's why, a, uh, that's why Herb sent me there. <laughs> there's, a, there's a park not far from where I live that has a fence that was split by the 1906 oh, earthquake. Wow. And the two, the two pieces are 20 feet apart. If there's one like there's one like that kind of up by Napa or the same yeah. thing up by so the did wineries. That, did that 20 feet happen at, all at that one time or did it yep. intergro- yep. incremental yep. after that also? No. Gremlins right. that right. go along. I, every, I have every a every question for you. I, I have a question. If your property line shifts 20 feet, <laughs> yeah. does it change your property line? <laughs> well, if you're right on the fault, your house has collapsed, so it doesn't matter anyway. <laughs> <laughs> no, you still own the property, <laughs> but you don't want to build on the house on the property. On the you just get it surveyed, uh, and you know you have a are. little tent you put up over there. So, and, then, cool. and that's two hundred thousand dollars just for the tent in Palo Alto, <laughs> right, Leonard? It's in California. Well, if it's a sloppy tent, <laughs> no plumbing, of course. You'd yeah, have, maybe you'd have to have a little potty bag or something. All right, so Robin, that was good. That was fun because it was quick and i think we got it i think we got it so, i gotta tell you robin i was looking at the map of ukraine every time they put it on the screen i said somebody's going to do this category i have to memorize the countries bordering it but i didn't <laughs> <laughs> I, personally i knew maybe five maybe okay, okay. Well, well, I mean, Belarus. You know what they so are. Is anybody going to get a tent oh, really oh absolutely <laughs> yeah because we could do the we could do the oh, capitals for three of them if, if oh, we yeah. had not talked oh, ourselves yeah. out one and switch to another we would Slovakia go. that fuck I forgot about Slovakia <laughs> Hungary the eastern half of what used to be Czechoslovakia mm-hmm. Bulgaria, no Romania yes oh so yeah Bulgaria is not yeah. uh, no. it's below Romania but we uh-huh. were thinking it might touch mm-hmm. huh. okay. Belarus is okay. And, who would, and who would have guessed that Russia borders Ukraine? Uh, yes, <laughs> that was a trick. That was a trick. <laughs> Not fair. Well, you know, I bet you Ukraine is the most searched uh, on maps right now. 
Maybe if you can say it verbally for the recording, uh, the viewing audience. Yeah, good idea. That's a very good idea, Karen. Okay, so the seven countries that border Ukraine are Belarus, with the capital of Minsk, Russia, capital Moscow, Moldova, mm -hmm. capital Chisinau, Romania, capital Bucharest, Hungary, mm -hmm. capital Budapest, Slovakia, capital Bratislava, 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 and Poland, Warsaw. Oh, we talked ourselves out of Slovakia. We had that for a bit, didn't we? I'm looking at the map and I'm really yeah. embarrassing. I was trying to think what would be on the other side of Crimea, but it's it's Crimea Russia. is Russia. Romero Romero got Russia. Romero was the other the, like the other point. side of Crimea is the Black yeah. Sea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. Yeah. But um, Georgia is closer than I thought. It's yeah, down there. But yeah. They talked me out of Slovakia and convinced me Georgia, or he did. Slovakia is just a really small border compared to the other. Well, Hungary's small too. Huh. Poland. So that's what they're doing, is they're going that way to get out. Mm -hmm. Belarus better get not get their ass in this. They're going to get their ass handed. Well, they do. They're, they're pretty much like, go right through them. Bel yeah. the, the, uh, uh, the armed forces that are going into um, Kiev are going in from, from Belarus. Belarus. Oh yeah, they're already bald. Belarus is already bald. Is it that <coughs> Colbert said he has the pubes on his um, of his uh, on the picture. of his victims. Yeah, of his victims. That was Belarus, huh? Yeah, I never even it. thought of Belarus before. But they said he's as dumb as a block of. Well, Belarus is um, Belarus. As well as Russia are banned from the whatever the Olympic uh, Paralympics yeah. and things, Paralympic. stuff that's coming up. And oh, uh, para also Paralympics. Russia. Yeah, there's Paralympics coming up starting tomorrow, I think. And then there's also um, like the World Championship figure skating. Everybody yeah. who Russia can is banned. Aren't they even pulling Russian dressing off the shelves? <laughs> Anything. It's all like so that's an interesting question. You know, morally, should we should we be mad at our Russian neighbor? No, I like no Russian. because it's not the Russian people; it's the Russian exactly, government. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. But the, and just like, don't take, the fact, the people you don't take action against all of them. You're you're not going to get have any effect on the entire on the. Yeah, uh, we're going to have to do what we have to do. We're right. obviously they're going to go through some shit. Some of the Russians are actually already demonstrating against it right right to put and as much pressure as possible as much nonviolent pressure as possible on all fronts as so, quickly yeah. as possible so we can get that get this over with as quickly as possible yeah absolutely just so depressing thank you it's, for it's really phone, tricky yeah. because it's like you know do we want to could we trigger world war three yeah are, are we are much? we making are it we, worse no. for putin by just absolutely are we going to make it worse for the world? Are we making him like a, 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 like a, what's it called? A, a cage right. animal that has no way, yeah. you know, everything's happening to me at once. Exactly. But Robin, that's why, that's why somebody guess. needs to assassinate the motherfucker. But yeah, you can't predict what he's going to do. That's right. why he's so yeah. dangerous. Right. Yeah. But the, yeah. the like problem Trump. is you back him into a corner and he's yeah. just yeah. going to. And then he, maybe he, a he's going to take the fires violence a nuclear up weapon and even then, higher. You know, oh my God. What's the alternative to pussyfoot around him? No, no, he does not have the ability as a single person. There are still people around him that need to agree with that. And let's hope that sanity prevails. Yeah. As they have in Schwarzenegger. To the Schwarzenegger. I tell you, you guys, this is, we used to spend, we, when we started doing social trivia, all we talked about was COVID. Oh yeah. my gosh, now it's Well, like, there was Trump too. Don't forget that. Well, we talked about yeah. Trump, but it was a lot of COVID and, and all we could do was just night after yeah. night after night we would talk about covid and i and i remember saying damn yeah. i'm looking for the days we will not be talking about covid anymore and yeah the pandemic comes to an end we're talking about world war three world war three okay <laughs> let's, let's talk about scores. both i wish putin would die no, we're not COVID. let's talk about our scores well, well, my, how are your family reacting to uh, the, the wars and rumors of wars thing? That must be really like a trigger. Oh, yeah. For religious folks. They shunned me. I, it's been three years, so I, I oh, don't, so you don't even know. know. I don't even know. Pat Robertson crawled out of the woodwork. To yeah. Talk about it. 
yeah. of course, with everything with him ends ends with it it going End into time. Israel and his giant, you mm. know, war that's going to end everything. Oh, yeah. you know, he he's old. He's ready to go to heaven, so he's well, ready no, for everything. Just, I'm, I'm ready for him to go to heaven too. All righty. <laughs> But you're gonna have Murmur happy. first. Uh, is he is he still alive? Last time I checked, he was. <laughs> yeah. Somebody check and see if Pat Roberts is still alive. Okay, so here's our scores. He doesn't look it as you saw him when he came out. When he came back out. Ten. You yeah, ask us first. Okay. Hey Rob, did anyone not get ten? Did anybody not get ten? No, we didn't yes. get ten. Uh, Oh. Let people get in. Let people have the pleasure of their time <laughs> in the sun. Right. Okay. Susan, so can we just you say from now on, we never say, did anybody not get in? Okay. So <laughs> let <laughs> me ask can ans our answers are stuck in a ship due to the supply chain issues? Ten. We got 10. Thank you, Gail. Good job. <laughs> All right. White seniors, that's the group I was in. Nine. What? Shouldn't that oh. be white haired seniors? Because it sounds like a clan group or something. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Time to rewatch Dr. Strangelove. Six. Oh, wow. We switched out some mm -hmm. stuff, and I don't know the capital of Poland, and nobody corrected me. <laughs> well, you, you know, better be on I it. saw that. Next, I, next time you do a category, it better be on Poland. Um, flowers and butterflies, please. Ten. <gasps> oh wow. wow! Oh my God! Oh, giving what, up food for Berlin. What do we need? What do we need? Nine. We need. We need how eight. much do we have? We need nine. nine. Yeah. Oh, we got nine. Oh, oh, nine. 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 Huh? That's yeah. A squeaker. A squeaker. The the maximum points you can get is fifty. So I am very impressed. We went tied for third. Forty-six. We're tied for fifth. I for I'm third. Impressed. Well, that's good. Team. Tied for last. Good job, team. That is really yes, good. very good job, team. I'm impressed. I couldn't get much fun. better than that. I'm putting my I'm putting this in. I've been do doing this, you guys, in case you didn't know. I've been putting on Facebook all of the questions and yeah. no answers, but I've been listing a lot of the questions questions as we go i've been doing that each week i got the damn hiccups and uh, susan susan yeah Boom. <laughs> oh thank you i was waiting for someone to do that so you, next week i have um i have where to where to go here carl i have carl and robin Is this kind of like whenever I was in church, and we would we would we would be sitting in the we'd be sitting there waiting for the church service to be over, and he'd be like, hey, "We're I'm waiting for people to come up," and he <clears throat> organ going, and he the pastor to be there. I know they're going to come up here, and they're going to what was it called a call or what did they call it? Whenever, altar call, altar call, and he'd be like. There's one out there. I just know it. Come on. I know you can. He wouldn't say who it is because, of course, he's been talking to him or whatever. You got to do it. It's like an altar call here for, for who's going to do. And you start feeling this pressure like, all right, I'll just go up there if it means we can get to lunch. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go home now. I don't want to keep doing this. So my altar call is I need two more categories and a bonus for next week. And I might not be here. So I really I'll do one. I'm Susan, I will be willing to do the bonus next week if I can still do the, my regular category. Yes. Weekend. Okay. Gail yeah. is doing bonus this week and then Pi Day. Oops, I spelled Pi. James is raising his hand on a regular round. Is that right? Did I see yeah. James? Oh yeah, my gosh. Regular. The pressure got to him. Okay. And I need one more. That's all. Just one. Just Debra, one. Deborah. Deborah. Deborah, thank you for volunteering I can again. do two. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Deborah said yes. Deborah right. says yes. Oh, yes. And we've almost got the pie day one filled. And that so far I have Avi, Gail, and Peggy, but I'm not so worried about it because I can pressure you guys. Just I wouldn't mind twist. doing the pie day. Who said that? Adrian? Oh, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Bonus. Oh, that's scary though. Pie day math. Pie day math. It's actually the 17th. You know what day it is, actually. It's St. Oh, Patrick's, St. Patrick's day. day. It's St. Patrick's Day. Ooh, new category. And the day after yeah. Pi Day. That's not Pi Ooh. Day. Ooh. Wait, is there a category Pi open? Day. I'll do that day. No. Pi Day is not St. Patrick's Day. You got the 17th all filled up? 
I need a bonus. It's the 18th, isn't it? St. Patrick's is the 17th. Pi Day is the 14th. That's yeah, right. so it's way after Pi Day. Oh, yeah. Maybe I should have a special Pi Day. Yeah, yeah. And tomorrow is I did last Army, time. Army Day because it's March 4th. Oh, oh man. Uh, <laughs> don't tell Putin. <laughs> tell Putin. The, this is what I was saying about the dream I had if all of us over at Carl's house. That's what was probably going to happen is we're just going to do really bad dad jokes that were so bad they're mm -hmm. not even dad jokes. <laughs> and that would be right in there with, with that. Yep. All right. So you guys are all done. You can go home now. Thank you, right, guys. Thank you for being with me. Appreciate <laughs> it. Really great, uh, nice great, everybody. great categories, you guys. Nice men. Yeah, I like that you had a lot of Russia, Putin, Ukraine stuff, and that really helped a lot. Yeah. Good job, team. Thank Hopefully, you, I'll see everybody. you next week. Bye. Bye. Bye.